Provence is one of the most beautiful and fruitful regions of France. It's been called the Garden of France. The dry Mediterranean climate is perfect for lavender, olive trees and grapevines. Herbs like rosemary and thyme also grow wild here. Star chef Pierre-Louis Poise uses only fresh herbs from the region in his dishes. He sends his kitchen help out twice a week to collect them. Uh, rosemary, I love this herb. It defines Provencal cuisine. It grows wild here because it's sunny here and the soil is rich in chalk. I love to cook with it all year long. Rosemary and thyme are real joys to have in the kitchen. The village of Egalière, where Poise has his restaurant Sous les Micoculières, has just 1,800 inhabitants. Here, in a courtyard in the shade of 200-year-old trees, guests can enjoy typical regional dishes that employ plenty of vegetables, seafood and fresh herbs. For Euromax, Poise is preparing a classic. Dau Provençal, stewed beef with herbs. The meat is rump roast. It has a fatty side and a leaner side. I've cut off a little of the fat here, but I'm leaving it on there, because it's an important flavor enhancer when you cook it. You have to have a little bit, but not too much, otherwise it tastes a bit disgusting. To make Daube Provençal, bring a red wine from the region to a simmer before adding onions, carrots and bulbs of garlic. Then you add olives and sauté in plenty of Provençal olive oil. The heavy dish tastes best when you add intense herbs like rosemary, thyme and bay leaves. For Pierre-Louis Poise, that's the perfect mix of Herbe de Provence. Now it's been sautéed, so I add the herbs. It's important to add them right at the beginning. Rosemary is very aromatic. It's a strong herb, and thyme is as well. When they cook in a sauce for three hours, they make it very aromatic and tasty. Another nice touch, oranges. They lend the otherwise hearty dish a light, fruity note. Then add red wine and place on the stove. It has to simmer at a low temperature for at least three hours. That's why I recommend making Dog Provençal early in the morning, or even the day before. Then, of course, it's really good. After three hours, drain the liquid and thicken it by simmering with a little cornmeal. Dog Provençal is an old peasant dish. On farms in the south of France, the farmers often baked fresh bread every morning. Afterwards, they'd use the heat of the still warm stove and leave the meat to cook all day until they returned from the fields. There you are. And a light rosé or a red wine from the region is the perfect accompaniment to a delicious plate of Daube Provençal.